On the 30th of May 1911, the Indianapolis 500 automobile race took place for the very first time. Welcome to History Pod. The Indianapolis 500, which took place at the Indianapolis Motor Speedway's two and a half mile oval track, was conceived by Carl G. Fisher. Designed to test the endurance of both drivers and their machines, the inaugural race featured 40 drivers covering 200 laps for a total distance of 500 miles. Consequently, pit stops were crucial to managing tyre changes, fuel refills and mechanical adjustments. The race saw intense competition and numerous lead changes, although Ray Haroon, driving a Marmon Wasp, maintained a steady pace to balance speed with the need to preserve his car's integrity over the long distance. Consequently, he only made four pit stops to change tyres. His car was also equipped with a rear-view mirror, which allowed him to race without a riding mechanic, who usually served as an extra set of eyes on the track. This gave Haroon a weight advantage and greater fuel efficiency, seeing him lead the race for a total of 88 laps. Haroon secured victory with a time of 6 hours, 42 minutes and 8 seconds, averaging a speed of 74.59 miles per hour. His victory, though, has been plagued with controversy ever since, as second-place finisher Ralph K. Mulford believed that he'd won, but that his laps had been miscounted due to confusion arising from a major crash alongside the malfunction of the circuit's new mechanical timing system. Despite a number of injuries and the tragic death of a racing mechanic, the success of the first Indianapolis 500 established the race as an annual event which has only been interrupted as a result of the two world wars. Today, it therefore remains one of the most prestigious automobile events in the world, attracting competitors and fans from across the globe.